Hey guys, in today's video, I'm answering a question that I've been getting lately, and that is how to hide the photos and messages application in iOS 12. I have a video for this in iOS 11 with a hack that allows you to remove the applications from the home screen using a trick, but Apple doesn't allow you to do that anymore. That has been patched, and you can't hide these apps by going into edit mode. So how do you hide photos and messages in iOS 12. Well, let's begin. The first thing you wanna do is head on over to the second or third page until you find the blank page. Go into edit mode and swipe over to the blank page and take a screenshot here. And we're gonna go ahead and save that, exit the edit mode. And we're just gonna keep that there. Now, what you wanna do is you wanna head on over to this website here, which I'll link you down below. And you wanna create a blank icon right here and click on add. And then the next thing you wanna do is choose file and then go to the photos here and then choose that screenshot that we just took, just like that. Now click send, and this is gonna upload the image, and then we'll be able to create a blank icon to diffuse the attention from the applications. And I'll get to that here in a few seconds. So here we go, it's creating uh, the icons here for the blank icons on the homepage. Scroll down, and there you have it. Now if you use a darker wallpaper, it's even better because you won't be able to see the dark icon that's created. So you wanna create one icon, the one plus one here, click on that and then click on add to home screen round here. And there we go, add to home screen. That's gonna add the blank icon to the home screen and you won't be able to tell that there's a blank icon. There it is, right there it is. So we're gonna move that to the third page and place it up top here. So there we go. So now we have a blank page with a blank icon, nothing there. The next thing we wanna do is go ahead and hide these two apps inside of a folder, the ones that we wanna hide. So we're gonna go with photos and messages. So let's do that, let's create a folder with those. Here we go, there they are. And now we're gonna move them all the way to the last page. And there we go, to a fourth page. So there's a blank page in between, then there's the fourth page for your two apps, and then there's the standard apps that you have on your device. Now this is not gonna stop anyone from finding these apps. You may be thinking, well, what about Spotlight Search? And what about Siri Suggestions? And you're right, here's how you turn that off. You wanna to go to Settings, you wanna to go to Siri, Siri Suggestions right here. You wanna turn Siri Suggestions off on the lock screen, home screen and search. And then you wanna find the messages application and also the photos application, which are the apps that we're using as an example here. So let's go to photos and we're gonna turn off Siri Suggestions and Siri show apps right there, show on apps. And then we're gonna do the same thing for messages and that's gonna prevent anyone from actually finding these apps on this device. So if I go right here, I don't have any suggestions. If I type photos, the Photos app will not show. It won't show on the lock screen. It's not a complete hack bypass or a complete hide, but it will deter someone from actually finding your photos and messages. If you leave your phone unattended, unlocked, it's a lot harder for the person to figure out where the apps are at because they can't find it. They can't search through Spotlight. It's just not as easy to find as if they were just on the home screen. So if I come across a bigger hack, something that will actually remove the apps from the home screen so no one can see them, uh, they don't do a follow-up video, but this is pretty good because if you leave your phone unattended, they can search them through Spotlight. They can find them from the lock screen, a home screen, or on the home screen here because they'll think, that's it, no more apps, and they'll turn right back. So there you guys have it. That is the hack for now on how to hide the photos and messages apps in iOS 12. I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.